Hey, it's the Circles Workshop. So I made a frame. Oh, trim for the box. I have the frame glued together. Next thing I need to do is to cut the splines across the top. Yeah, I know, bad lighting, bald head, shiny. Ah. Neighbors just pulled up. I know, I'm crazy, talking to myself. Anyway, uh, the top of the trim. We'll see how it works. I think it'll be pretty cool. Sorry, battery. Um, just used uh, tape and epoxy. Clamped it pretty well. So I just used the belt sander to clean off the epoxy off the joints. It turned out pretty well. I still have to go over and even it out a little bit. Some of the places are kind of crazy. Um, then go back and sand it with the palm sander. It turned out pretty well. So I used the epoxy. The joints weren't that great, but kind of decorated trim. Be fine. So I wanted to show you the setup for this. So these are little frames, just a lighter gauge set at a 45. We'll stop there and just cut it through. Didn't really measure it, just cutting it doesn't really matter where it's at. So I have this spline material and now I'll just have to get that glued in and then sand it down and figure out what else I want to do with it. Well I have all the splines glued in now I just have to clean them. Here's a quick way to clean them out a little. Let's see if I get that in frame. See it? There it is. And <laughs> so there's the box and that's kind of how it will go. I know it looks a little thin through here. Um, I don't know. I might put something underneath there just to kind of play around. I have these that I kind of cut the other day. Might be kind of cool. I don't know. Something like that maybe. Thank you for watching. It's fun building these. It's my process on making uh, whatever you want to call splines there. Corner spines, maybe? Uh, this was fun. Um, it really was. My first video that I kind of edited it together. Um, and I'm saying um a lot. Anyway, hope you guys have a great day. <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you. And yeah, I did the salute. Goodbye.